I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. straight face guys welcome back it is obviously spirit week and boy are they bringing some spirit around here i've got some totals for you guys but i'm gonna save that to the end um first things first today starts testing for the fsa ela good luck to everyone i know some of you will not see these announcements until either before or maybe even after you have tested just know that we need you to maximize every opportunity for the next two weeks. So you're going to take the writing test this week. That writing score gets combined with next week's reading score for your graduation score, the score that you need for the FSA ELA test for graduation. Give it your all. Do not cheat yourself. Really try, take advantage of the time that you have to get the best out of yourself and onto that paper so that we can check one more box towards that graduation stage. All right, guys, <laughs> what do you have? I don't really have anything. Again, good luck to all of our juniors that are taking that test today. As you're, the rest of the uh, schools watching this, you guys are testing. So um, good luck and we'll finish it up next week. The only thing I have is I had a good time yesterday in the cafeteria watching the donut eating contest. That was something else. And I do want to give a shout out to Miss Julie, Miss Shannon, and Miss Carmen, who are our lunchroom ladies. They did participate in that uh, donut eating contest. And the winner was Carmen. She <laughs> ate the donut faster. And um, you know, I don't know if that's a good thing or bad thing, but congratulations, Carmen. Have your attention yet? <laughs> so some of you freshmen are going to be rocking tutorial today. So listen up. After school, if you are staying for tutorial and you have turned in that permission slip, we will need to see you down in the commons area. So you will come down and out of the building just like you normally do. And we will divvy you up by the teachers you're planning to stay with. Remember, we have one for every content area. And then we'll send you to those rooms. If you have your, Mr. Adler told me, if you have your permission slip today, and as long as you have it to him by lunchtime, he's going to extend you a little grace and get your bus pass ready so you can start staying today. So please get that to him as quickly as you can. Ms. Smith? You're on mute. Just kidding. I was screaming rocker, so I didn't want you guys to bust your eardrums. Oh, my wig is tight, sorry. Um, so we are going to have a blast here at freshman campus dressing up rocking out so we look forward to seeing you. Um, also, we did not get to participate in spirit day games because of the rain, but promise you, you will have that opportunity later in the week to participate in those games. So freshmen, get all of your energy ready. We have to collect some points. We're behind right now. Okay, we, we got to get it together. All right, Miss Myers over to you. I have a fan club guys. So give me a second. Oh, come on, yeah! yeah. Professor! Woo! Okay, sorry. <laughs> that. <laughs> oh, I don't know how I'm gonna finish this up, but I'm gonna try. Freshmen, we are keeping count of how many dressed up yesterday. We just don't have those numbers quite yet. So we'll get your points caught up um, by tomorrow. <laughs> Um, and today you'll have the opportunity to play. Go and play those games. That's where you're gonna win some points for your classes. So right now, freshmen, I don't have any points for you, but don't worry. We're gonna keep counting and get you in the mix tomorrow. All right, are you ready for this? Seniors, you have 208 points. Woo! Oh wait, juniors, you know how many points you have? 509. Congratulations. Oh, but wait, there's a sophomore class. Sophomores, are you ready? 
Are you sure you're ready? Seniors, I need you to listen to this. 1,219 points. What? All right, so that's just day one totals. Things can still change. Get out, play those games at lunches, come dressed. <laughs> Tomorrow is class shirt day, so you're wearing your favorite class shirt to represent your graduating class. Every single shirt for your class will count. And you're gonna play games at lunch to help win um, your team some, or your class some points. Don't forget about Money Wars. That's taking place each day. Every dollar you contribute is a point. Every dollar in change is a negative point. We wanna see lots of participation as all proceeds go to help the backpack program. Oh, today is definitely going to be a memorable one as together we Move forward. Be great. Be awesome. <laughs> Bye, guys. All day. <laughs> hey, it's Wellness Wednesday. Welcome back for another day. Uh, and you guys are going to have another wellness video after this for our mental health curriculum for October. So we're going to be quick. Some short announcements, the information that everybody wants to know. How's our class doing in Spirit Week? So the updated total, seniors, you came on strong, more than doubled your score. However, you're sitting at 587 points. Woo! But don't look twice. Juniors coming up closely behind you. They have 1,073 points. Sophomores, man, oh man, 2,077 points right now. These guys are the ones to beat, showing out in their dress-up attire and at the afternoon games and in the change wars. And then freshmen, you guys are doing great, 206 points. Remember, games at lunch and dress-up time. I, of course, I think the freshmen won yesterday for the dress-up day. Holy cow, that was awesome. Okay, um, one more announcement that I have. You, some of you noticed I was sitting outside during lunches. These are our new pink out shirts for this coming year. It says family, family, no fights alone. alone. Thank you, I can't remember. So in this family, no one fights alone. We have these pink out shirts. Pink out is next Friday, hear me, next Friday. These shirts are $10 a piece. Go Gold is this Friday. If you don't have your Go Gold shirt, Mr. Anderson is selling those out in automotive um, during school, but also after school. He's there late, I left at six o'clock last night and he's still there selling shirts. Those shirts are $12 a piece to buy and get those. You want to show out this Friday for Go Gold. Okay, we're going to do things a little bit out of order. Um, we have some shout outs. Yesterday, the girls' soccer was announced. So I want to give congratulations. Or Ms. Goggins, do you want to do yours first? Absolutely. We'll go and do the JV girls' soccer. Congratulations, too. Yasmin Abanza, Judith Borgia, Anai Bustos, Anai Cavillo, Abigail Calzada, Victor Cardosa, Victoria Gar Cardosa, excuse me, Risa Castaneda, Princess Espinay, Adamar Adamaris Fernandez, Annabelle Garcia, Rosa Salas Garcia, Melissa Mojica, Edith Morales, and Natalia Nav Navaretti. Naomi Nunez, Lindsay Saucedo, McKenna Smith, Carla Solis, Elizabeth Soriano, and um, team managers will be Crystal Garcia, Celine, Celine Rivera, and Esmeralda Toribio, and last but not least, Samaya Yamin. So congratulations. Congratulations. All right, your girls' uh, varsity soccer players are Drina Aguilar, Ileana Boyer, Araceli Cisneros, Giselle Delgado, Alexis Garcia, Caitlin Guerrero, Jacqueline Jaimez, Daisy Luano, Jade Martinez, Julie Martinez, Jasmine Mora, Maria Perez, Haley Quisenberry, Kimberly Rio, Isabella Saucedo, and your goalies, 
Leslie Cruz, Aubrey First, Emma Rollerson, and Jenna Slayton. Congratulations, guys. Super proud of you all. All right, Mr. Stewart. Those are big teams. I'm looking forward to seeing them play, by the way. Uh, hey, I got to give a bit of a shout out to Miss uh, Gibson, Sharp Sergeant Gibson and Miss Mullins. They are having a good time in that cafeteria. They had music going yesterday, games. Um, it seems like the kids that are having the most fun are the ones who are winning the points war. So fun equals points. Get in there and have some fun and your points will go up. I guarantee it. Um, also, uh, teachers, good news and bad news. I'll be sending out an email today. Duty will change in the morning. Oh, by the way, I didn't get recognized twice yesterday by two of our teachers. One thought I was a sub, started getting on to me. And the other one came by me in the uh, hallway and kind of took a double take and said, I did not even recognize you. <laughs> hey, I just wore a hat and boots. <laughs> I wonder if you two heard that yesterday. My, my sister yeah. was here on campus and I, at first she didn't even know who I was. So that was pretty good. Um, <laughs> so we, we had some identity issues as well, Mr. Stewart. Yeah. <laughs> so for our freshmen, make sure you get counted today, um, black or white. Hopefully you got counted during third period. At lunch today, if you haven't had lunch in your second lunch, come play some games. It's a lot of fun. Um, and make sure that we get your pictures because I'm posting those and mamas and daddies and everybody is, are loving to see your spirit this week. So please make sure you get in those photo ops and build those memories. Nothing for me. It's back to you. Hey, short and sweet. All right. Are you, are you guys ready for this one? Here we go. You ready? As together we move forward. Be great. Be great. Dang it! Be Robbins. <laughs> All day. All day. This is Ms. Davis, um, Anime Club sponsor. I am here to tell you guys about our fall or Aki competition this year. So we're going to be using this as our fundraiser and it's going to have three categories. So the first category is going to be an art competition, which is going to have a $3 entry fee. Second is pumpkin carving competition, which will have a $5 entry fee. And third is our fruit and veggie competition, which will have a $3 entry fee. So all of these art competitions are gonna be tied to themes. So the themes are fall, Halloween, Japanese folklore, or just something generally spooky or scary. Um, anything in those categories is gonna be A-OK. -okay. For the art, it is, uh, we're accepting 2D, 3D, um, or digital art. For the pumpkin, obviously it needs to be on a pumpkin, and then the fruit and veggie, that, we're gonna leave that up to your interpretation. All of these are going to be linked to a prize. We have a lovely panel of judges that is going to be taking a look at the submissions and determining who our winners are. And based on that information, we will award the prize to our winners for each category. Um, if you would like more information, feel free to email me. I'm gonna put my email in this video. And if you would like to stop by my room 1409 to get more information, you are welcome to do so as well. Um, I hope to see you guys participating and I can't wait to see those lovely submissions. Have a great day.